Hey guys, Geneva here. Um, how are you? Um, I am here today making my very first video uh, that will be on the internet, um, which is a little bit nerve-wracking, so forgive me for that. But I'm here to talk about something that I don't usually talk about um, very often on my page. If you follow me on Geneva Diva, thanks for the support everyone. It's amazing and hopefully I make you smile on there um, at least once a day. But I, you know, I want to talk about a topic that's like less, uh, less talked about and um, less focused on and something that I think can have the same impact as the things that I talk about, like happiness and health and fitness and beauty. Um, I really think it can have the same, if not a bigger impact. Um, but it's something that's not comfortable for a lot of people. Um, and that is finances. <laughs> yes, money. Um, I am passionate about this because when I came out of my master's degree and having gone to Drexel for undergrad, I owed $120,000, yes, um, in student debt alone. And I had no idea what to do with that except be extremely overwhelmed and like beaten down and, you know, spend a ton of time on the phone calling people up to say, I can only pay $50 a month on this. I can't afford to pay the thousands of dollars you want me to pay in monthly uh, bills. So, you know, that's what I did for a long time. I just did the minimum and knew that it was something I would probably be paying for the rest of my life, but I just said, oh, that's normal. Everyone does this, and, um, you know, I'll just make those payments. And I had learned that um, I guess your student debt gets forgiven if you die, so that was my plan. Um, and, and that's not a great place to be. And, and it was just kind of like a dark cloud I had. And I just figured, let me brighten up the other pieces of my world and, and deal with it. Um, until I had like a huge wake up call. And that wake up call was just like a reality check. You do not want to be making those payments when you are, it was like $800 a month. You, you want to pay that while you're retired, trying to have like the best time of your life. And, living off, you know, who knows, um, retirement, you don't get paid that much, and it depends how much you save and all of that, but, like, I don't need that in my life, uh, and I, I kind of learned that I could write a plan and figure it out and, and pay it off, um, and when I did this, it was so incredibly empowering, like, I can't even tell you the reality, like just knowing that was reality to pay off my $120,000 to pay off our outstanding other debts like our car loan and to pay off our mortgage and it would only take us 10 years, 10 years. So when I was th like, you know, when I'm 37, I can live with that and, and knowing that, you know, anything extra I do is just that. I don't sacrifice, um, doing fun things. I don't sacrifice going and doing the things we love to do. I just put my money to work for us. And, and we made a plan. We put our money to work. And now, you know, we've in, in the last year have paid off $50,000 towards those student loans, $50,000. So by the end of 2014, I will not owe Sally May anything and I will be done with her and I can't wait. Um, and, you know, I said this to a friend the other day and she really was like, Geneva, that's amazing, and you need to be proud of that, and you need to share that because people are really struggling with that aspect of their life. People are really drowning in that, especially student loan debt, um, and and you can help them. And so um, she kind of brought to light that this is one area I haven't spoken up and, and started helping people in. And so what I'm here to do today is just to say I want to help you. If you are like I was, and you don't see any hope in coming out of that debt, if you don't see any hope in paying off your bills, or, you know, maybe you have medical bills you didn't pay, or you, you need to pay, or you have, um, you know, other kinds of debt, credit card debt, I know, like, I went through paying all that off when I first got off out of college, um, so let me help, um, I'm here for you, and I'm looking to help some people 
this month create their plan to financial freedom um, to get that feeling that it is possible and that if you put your money to work for you in a smart way, it will it will become reality, it will be done, and you will be lighter and freer and happier and less stressed and feel absolutely amazing. Um, and so if I'm speaking to you at all, if you, you know, maybe you already have been working towards this, but you're not exactly sure what or how to, to really put it to work, please, please like or PM, PM me um, and we'll get to work. And for those of you who have, really all of you, <laughs> anyone I've ever asked for for support has been incredible. So I just wanted to take a second and say thank you, thank you, thank you for all of your support, your enthusiasm, everything. It's been absolutely amazing. Um, and I love and appreciate you. Uh, love and gratitude, as always. See you later.